Good evening, YouTubers, friends, and family from across the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide. We are on January 30th, 2019. Welcome to another surviving day on this planet. Welcome to another video from Morning Dew. We're going to start out here at the Pacific Disaster Center, looking at the major disasters from around the world. We have a winter storm that is developing across British Columbia right now. And as well, extreme cold temperatures all across North America right now. Northeastern United States getting some relief, but now the West is about to go down to minus 29 here in Alberta, and that's without the wind chill, folks, and that is Celsius. So, please stay aware and prepared, layer up, and be ready for a Arctic freeze. Looking at the major disasters, wanted to look at the volcanoes from today and as well large earthquakes, East Pacific rise, but also looking at Fuego Volcano updated today, Popocapetito, Revendador, Planchon, Putera, Sabancaya. A lot of volcanoes did get an update today. around the world the biggest thing is the cold temperatures in the northern hemisphere and as well these extreme flooding conditions across northeastern Australia Queensland Australia receiving copious amounts of rain over the past few days and will continue to do so for the next five days show you there in the five-day forecast coming up I wanted to have a look at our Sun as well so yesterday our Sun did produce a C class and maybe even an M class flare after that you can see the large fiery side there and as well a plasma filament from the southern hemisphere of the Sun you can see the plasma filament in these frames here you'll see a large dark hoop and then it just yeah rips away and that is earth facing wanted to get a look at the sunspot region under another light you can see on the left side there is another sunspot region coming in and it looks active another closer look here C class flare maybe even an M class flare after that see that wow also looking at our large coronal hole that has not dissipated at all so corona wind stream will be intensifying again I want to thank you all of my new subscribers to morning Dew daily events worldwide God bless you all and thank you for watching and supporting this channel daily events worldwide here's your five-day forecast brought to you by Meteor Earth and Meteor Mike looking at North America as that Arctic freeze and polar vortex invades northeastern United States and as well as Canada. You can see minus 40 temperature hanging out here for the next five days in Manitoba. With temperatures reaching up to minus 29 by Monday and Tuesday next week here in Alberta. And thanks to the Chinook ahead of time, keeps all that moisture away, which is not good. We are really dry. Large low pressure center getting ready to set up into the Hudson Bay. Winter in full effect all across the northern hemisphere right now. With extreme cold temperatures gripping humanity. And for the last year and a half, I've been warning everybody about this. Things are going to change drastically. Watch for a large 
low pressure system developing here in northwestern United States as well. Parts of Washington will be getting snow in the next three days. I had suspected maybe 10 days, but that large low pressure system coming from the north will be bringing some snow to the Washington area. Looking at this situation in Australia, you can see the five day forecast still has not changed. That low pressure system keeps spinning and spinning and coming onto land. Look at that, day after day. They probably haven't seen the sun in three days and won't for another five. So this will be an extreme weather event for Australia, parts of Queensland. Wow. Please share this video with your friends and family from across the world so you can help stay aware and prepared, keep humanity awake to the craziness going on in our planet right now. We also do have some flooding conditions in South America, parts of Brazil, Buenos Aires. Have a look at our North Pole right now. Temperatures all around the Northern Hemisphere. Polar vortex has definitely grown. Minus 44. Wow. Southern Hemisphere. Antarctica. Please, if you'd like to join me tonight for a live stream, I'm going to be doing a live stream for a couple hours. I want to address a situation, a mental illness situation. So I'm going to be posting a Let's Talk live stream. Please join me tonight, right after I eat some supper. But yeah, I was wanted to show you here the large low pressure system coming in from the north parts of northwestern United States watching definitely some cold and snow conditions coming to you guys in Washington this is the last 24 hours for earthquakes largest being a 5.9 East Pacific rise 4.5 in Nicaragua today and a 5.6 in Tatal Chile also watching a concerning earthquake swarm in the Caribbean Dominica to be more specific because they in that area are not reporting any earthquakes we, as you can see here there have been many and a couple of really deep ones 100 kilometers that's 5.3 in high high fall 2.6 in Hawaii 4.9 in Taiwan, 4.5 in Babana, Indonesia, as well as the Mariana Islands, Mariana's Trench, popping off a 4.7 today. Thank you for watching today. This has been Mike with Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide. This is the last seven days for earthquakes. Thanks for watching today. Stay aware and prepared. There's been a lot of deep earthquakes recently. Thanks for watching. Stay young and have fun and get your morning due. Bye-bye. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world. Thank you.
Thank you.